Hi, what's going on? My name is Arant. In this video, I'm going to show you how to navigate through Facebook, also known as Meta Business Manager. And it is super important to understand how Meta Business Manager works if you're using WhatsApp Business API. Now, I'll tell you when it's going to be super helpful. Number one, if you're very confused about adding your payment method, then you should know how Meta Business Manager works so that you can easily find where to add my payment method or if in future you have to change the payment method, you should be able to understand Facebook Business Manager. If you're planning to onboard multiple businesses inside Facebook Business Manager so that you can create WhatsApp number for all those businesses, then you need to understand how Facebook Business Manager works. Or even if you have a single business but inside of that business, you want to have multiple phone numbers. You need to understand how Facebook Business Manager works. So if you're able to easily navigate through Facebook Business Manager, you can do a lot of things inside of the platform. So let me just simplify what is Facebook Business Manager and how do you navigate through a Facebook Business Manager? Okay, so Facebook Business Manager have this hierarchy right and what sits on the top of that hierarchy is your facebook account so let's say i have a facebook account on my name and then inside of that facebook account i can go ahead and create a facebook business manager and can i create multiple facebook business manager the answer is yes so what you can do inside a single facebook account you can create multiple Facebook business managers just like this. And why we use Facebook manager is to manage all the assets that Facebook or Meta has given to us. So the first thing that I'm going to do is take you to a Facebook business manager. I'm going to show you how a Facebook business manager looks like. Okay. So what I need to do is go to watchimp.com. Now I have created a short link which allows you to quickly go to your Facebook business manager instead of figuring out, you know, how to find your Facebook business manager. So all you have to do is go to watchim.com slash business dash settings. Again, I'm going to put the link in the description below. You can always bookmark this. So just go to this link and this is going to allow you to select your Facebook business manager because like I told you before, one Facebook account, can go ahead and create multiple Facebook business manager. So the moment I try to access my Facebook business manager, the first thing it will ask me, which Facebook business manager do you want to access? So let's say I want to access one of the Facebook business manager whose name is Gromi Organic LLC, right? So this over here, the one, the, the dashboard that you see over here is my Facebook business manager where I can manage multiple assets like my business pages, my ad account, my business asset groups, my applications, Instagram account and WhatsApp account, right? And WhatsApp account is nothing but your WABA, your WhatsApp business account. Okay, so let me just take you back to the board mix. And here, what we just saw is inside a, inside a Facebook account, we can create multiple Facebook business managers, which you just saw over here. This is your Facebook business manager. Right now, inside of Facebook Business Manager, you can create multiple WABA account. Okay, multiple WhatsApp business accounts. So let me just take you to that and show you multiple WABAs over here. So what you see over here, all these names over here, these are nothing but your WABA account. This is WABA number one, two, three, four, and five. Right. So we can go to any of these WABA account by scrolling down below and clicking on WhatsApp manager. The moment I click over here, it is going to take me to my WABA account. This right over here, what you see right now is my WABA account. Okay. So again, it's pretty simple. Like I just showed you, we went to the Facebook business manager and then inside of the Facebook business manager, we found WABA. Now, what if I want to switch my Facebook business manager? I don't want to use this Facebook business manager. I want to manage this for my other business. All I need to do is go over here in my Facebook business manager and switch to any other Facebook business manager you want to switch to. Okay. So I'm going to a different Facebook business manager, which is Gromi organic, right? 
and you can see there are different waba accounts under this uh business manager right again if i want to go to inside any of the waba account i can switch between them and go to the waba manager from here you see this waba is different than this waba over here because this waba falls inside a different business manager which was this and this waba account falls under a different business manager so like i explained before that one meta account can have multiple business managers and one multiple one um, business manager can have multiple waba accounts just like what we saw over here right now inside of a waba account we can have multiple phone numbers just like this if you see over here there are two phone numbers so inside of one waba we can have multiple phone numbers right now why not creating individual waba for each phone number because when you when you add a phone number inside the same waba it shares the same message templates so all the message message templates that you have created inside one waba you can reuse that with other phone numbers that is the advantage that you get but if you don't want to share the message templates between two numbers what you need to do is go ahead and create a new waba account okay so coming back to this you can see these are two different phone numbers if i want to access any of these i just need to click on the setting buttons if i want to uh, go to their profile i can go over here and change the profile picture i can change the display name i can also request for a green tick right from here i can add more business information and uh, you know change whatever that we want so i hope i was able to make you understand how the meta business manager structures look like okay now i'm going to give you something that will allow you to easily navigate you through all these pages right so all you have to do is go to your a uh, browser and type watchim.com/links right watchim.com/links and make sure you bookmark this page why because this page have handy links to all the pages that i showed you right now so if you want to go to your waba account all you have to do is go to this link which is watchim.com/business settings if you want to go to your uh, security center you can go to this link If you want to go to your Waba, which is WhatsApp Manager, you can go to this link. If you want to go to your payment methods, you can go to this link. And if you want to go to your phone numbers, you can go to this link. Okay. So what I'm going to do is take you through some other important sections, and I'm going to tell you where exactly you can find them. Because let's say if you want to connect your payment method. right so you need to know where exactly you can find your payment method so again just to uh, you know declutter everything i'm just going to close all the tabs and let's say i want to add my payment methods because the very first mistake a lot of business owners do when they create their waba account uh, they forget adding their payment method because meta is going to bill you per conversation and if you don't have a, a payment method added you won't be able to send message you can always receive message and have the incoming conversation that's absolutely fine but you can never send an outgoing business message until your payment method is connected okay so how to go to your uh, uh, payment method how do you find where is your payment method okay it's pretty simple to find that here is a link for that if you want to uh, immediately go to that uh, section So you're just going to click on this link watchim.com/paymentmethods it's going to ask you for your waba account just click on uh, sorry your meta business manager just click on your meta business manager now as you can see i have three options for which you know i can manage my payments one is my ad account one is my whatsapp business account and one is my meta verified accounts so what i need to manage is the whatsapp business account so i'm going to click over here and then select my waba account So let's say I select this Waba account. Okay? And you can see over here my payment method is already connected so I don't have to do anything. 
But if your payment method is not connected, you want to add the payment method right over here. All right, so now I'm going to give you a quick revision of how we have navigated through everything. So what we need to do is go to watchim.com slash business settings so that you can access your Meta Business Manager. Select your business account. So I'm going to select one of our business account over here. Right now inside of the business account, we can switch between multiple WABA accounts. So you can see this is one of the WABA account. This is another WABA account. Now, if you're trying to migrate from your existing business solution provider to Watchimp, there can be chances that you already have another WABA created. And what you need to do is go ahead and delete that WABA. So to delete that WABA, you will first have to delete the phone number. And to delete the phone number, you need to go inside of the WABA and find the phone number which is connected to the uh, phone number. So I'm going to go to uh, go inside of the uh, WABA. And then let's say if I want to delete this number, I'm going to click on this delete. Then I can come back and delete the entire WABA account. Right? This is only when you want to migrate from your existing uh, you know, uh, business solution partner. Because th if you want to use the same phone number, you have to remove that from your existing provider and connect it with Watchim. Right now, once we go inside of Waba, like I said before, you can find multiple phone numbers. If you want to switch between different phone numbers that you have inside one Waba account, you can switch that from here. Now, there are there are chances where you might not find this. Like there are certain uh, times where I've noticed that, you know, this uh, drop down does not appear. So all you have to do is go ahead and refresh the page and the drop down will appear and then you can just change between any of these. That's it. So I think I've given you a complete walkthrough of Facebook Business Manager. If you have any question about Facebook Business Manager, drop down in the comment below. I'll be happy to answer and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.